Good morning, YouTube. It's Ain't That A Mother. Um, I recorded a video for you guys last night, um, but in the middle of the video, my blueberry ran out of storage. That's what I call my Blackberry playbook. I call it blueberry. Um, but it ran out of storage last night in the middle of my video. Um, and then this morning, the video became kind of irrelevant because in the other video, I was telling you guys about how I was still waiting on my smiley face. This morning, I actually received my smiley face, so yay for that. Um, and then there was a couple of new subscribers that I got and new people that I found that I had subscribed to. So I just wanted to give a shout out to a couple of you guys. So Heavenly Keisha, Mrs. Hayes 0921, Sweet KY Chick, Too Fierce to Hold Back, Believe GNRH. Uh, Nina Brosia 89 I hope I said that right let me know if I didn't and um, Lady and Anna's journey so special shout outs to all of you guys welcome fingers crossed baby dust um, loads and loads of it let me know if you guys need anything questions whatever um, and then to my girls uh, Mel from two lesbians one journey or her YouTube name is 808 finest and to Miss Lolly um, special shout outs to them those are my girls I talk to them almost every single day um, and to Mel I'm at work now I'm on Wi-Fi so hopefully today sometimes we'll be able to Skype um so yeah basically this morning I got my smiley face so I'll probably be in simming um, tomorrow morning before work and tomorrow evening once I get home my hair is kind of weird it's like bigger on one side than it is on the other it's still kind of wet in the middle so I'm hoping by the time it dries it figures itself out gets its life together um but um in my other video I talked about how yesterday me and Papa tried to go to the place that we saw on man versus food um, this place called um, Damalisi's that's supposed to have the, the city's best shrimp po' boy. We were bored yesterday. Um, didn't really have anything to do, so we decided to go and hunt this place down and see if they really did serve the city's best po' boy. And, of course, they're closed on Thursdays. Um, but I guess that's what I get for bragging yesterday on Facebook about the good sleep that I got. So, karma. Um, let's see. I also wanted to talk to you guys about how, um, I know like during ovulation tensions get really, really high. Um, but just a little technique that I use, um, I call it my, um, <laughs> I call it, sorry about that. That's my phone. It's probably a text message from Facebook. It is someone who saw my smiley face on there this morning all of my Facebook all of my YouTube everything comes directly to my phone so if you guys ever need to reach me I have no excuse unless it's like after midnight my time which I go to bed like an old woman so um but yeah so tensions get high um around the time of ovulation um and I just call it my hater shield and excuse my language but bullshit just slides right off um I make it very known during that whole entire week like look I have more important things to be focused on I can't put my energy and my time into this and I just let it be that um, so there's absolutely nothing wrong with that I know to some people who don't understand it may come across as me being bitchy or cold but that's just me you know preserving myself and my future child so um, love one another take it easy on each other be understanding but at the same time choose your battles everything is not worth dealing with during the time of ovulation it just isn't um, I was talking to Lolly this morning um, about how, oh, that's Stephanie. Hi, Stephanie. That was you that just texted me on Facebook. Um, but um, I was just talking to Lolly about how this cycle, I just seem more relaxed. Um, but in a way, it kind of makes me feel guilty as if this cycle isn't as special. Um, and it's not that at all. I mean, um, I don't feel the need to sleep on my tank right next to my bed like I did last cycle. <laughs> but I do have it um, right in the hallway. And every time I walk past it, I kind of rub it like Showtime at the Apollo, like Kiki Shepard. Um, so um, I am ready. I'm excited. But I'm a lot more calm, which in a way is a good thing and a bad thing. Like I said, in a bad way, it makes me feel guilty that I'm not as excited as I was last cycle but on the other hand it makes me feel more hopeful like well I'm a lot more calm this time so maybe that gives me better chances of it actually working um let's see what else did I want to talk to you guys about um Lolly's blanket is coming along very well I actually had to make a Walmart run yesterday and get more yarn for that 
um, but I don't plan on showing the blanket. I did send her a picture of it already, um, and I'm going to be sending her progress pictures, um, you know, as time goes on and it, you know, gets closer to completion. So I'll leave it up to her whether or not she wants to show you guys that. Um, anyone else who would like for me to make them a blanket, let me know. Um, I have um, a couple of ideas on different styles and things and then I want to start making what I'm going to call Gaby blankets um, which will basically be like the rainbow colors you know Roy G Biv um, but ba for babies um, and I guess I could probably even make bigger sizes of them for adults as well so I already plan on making one for Mel but I have to finish Lolly's first so Mel you have a Gaby blanket coming um, and anyone else who wants one just how let me let me know I thought about selling them at one time but really that's not something that I'm gonna be getting into um, especially for you girls my YouTube girls we're closer than that we're like sisters on here so I wouldn't charge you guys but if you want one just let me know um, as far as the tutorial goes I do have the beginning part of a tutorial recorded but because I don't have an editor it's kind of a pain in my butt um, so anyone who has any ideas for editors let me know it looks like I'm gonna just have to break down and get another laptop because I tried to get the blueberry to avoid getting a laptop but it looks like it would just be easier to be able to do all my editing and all of that from a laptop so hopefully I'll be able to do that within the next couple of weeks um, and then I also have an eye doctor's appointment this week too I need contacts really really bad my vision is getting worse um, so that's another thing that I plan on doing during my two-week wait um that's really about it um shout out to my brother dj and my brother lee less um that's really about it um if you guys have skype or tango hit me up let me know i'd be more than happy to do some face-to-face -face, uh stuff with you guys misha and mika i love you guys to pieces um i know i talked to you guys yesterday and that was awesome um follow me on twitter friend me on facebook as many of you have thank you for that um that's really about it um i'm gonna go ahead and upload this video for you guys i kind of like this lighting here i might use this from now on because i usually post my videos on friday anyway so maybe instead of recording at home on thursday night i'll just record from here on friday mornings and post um so yeah i guess that's it um fingers crossed baby dust to everybody baby dust to me um i'm gonna be doing my insims i'm gonna be doing my insims tomorrow morning i'll probably be getting up like maybe an hour hour and a half before work and um doing my first insim and then i'm gonna do my second one when i get home so i will let you guys know how that goes and um be easy lemon squeezies i'll see you guys around take care